Please don't make fun of me because I don't know what the hell I'm doing here. South Padre Island means different things for different people. For my family, it means a quick getaway in a relaxing environment full of beautiful memories. Robbie and I decided to take a quick trip right before the spring break madness started. As I've mentioned, I created this channel to share my new experiences with the YouTube community. I hope that some of our adventures will inspire and motivate some of you to leave the house and your comfortable sofa once in a while. And uh, what we want to do is we're going to try our luck at fishing. Unfortunately, Sammy, Samantha wasn't able to make it with us this time around. You know, it's going to be Robbie and I, you know, uh, giving it a go and uh, we're going to see how it turns out. But first, we got to get some gas. Supreme all the way. As always, we deflated our tires before entering Beach Axis 6. set up camp and started getting our fishing gear ready. Oh, what's this? Wow. Is it shooting, right? Yeah. Look at that Every shit. time we come out, we learn something new. This may be common knowledge to many, but we didn't know anything about ghost shrimp or what some people call yabbies. They are almost translucent and are commonly found along our beaches. Ghost shrimp create those tiny holes in the sand. I didn't know they were used as bait, but I figured that much on the spot. Okay, so we found this little shrimp, this little guy right here buried in the sand. And we're gonna try to see Please don't make fun of me because I don't know what the hell I'm doing here. All right. I don't even know if I'm hooking him the right way, but we're going to cast him out. Let's see if uh, somebody wants this guy. All right, so Samantha wasn't able to make it. So we're going to cast her rod in her honor. Let's see what happens. It didn't take long before the fish started biting. Unfortunately, I didn't catch this on camera. But check out the tip of my rod. Broken half. I don't know what it was, but something was at the other end. Trying to bring it in. And this just broke. Uh, I found this one at Bass Pro Shop and uh, I did get a warranty on it. Uh, so Hopefully, hopefully they'll take care of it. 
We continued to fish and ended getting a few keeper size whiting that I decided to prepare for dinner. While Robbie got ready to release one of the smaller fish we were planning on using for bait. So we're gonna release the final fish that survived. The um, one survivor, huh? Yeah. He was gonna be bait. But now, he's gonna be free. Let's go. What a day what a day uh, did a little fishing did a little relaxing and uh, now we're ready to head in how are you feeling son Good. you put those uh, fishing rods to the test mm -hmm. and uh, caught some fish right and I cooked that fish or those fish and yeah that was part of our dinner today pretty neat so now I don't know how clear a shot you'll have here but yeah Sun is setting down on us and it's time to head home it was important that we got out here where we did with spring break coming up in a week we had to get out here to avoid the crowds now we'll have to wait and see if there's an opportunity to return between spring break and holy week. Thank you once again for watching this video. As always, please subscribe, like, and share if you enjoyed the content.